Newman and Lamode local government areas are two out of the nine that have been affected by this year's flood as a result of torrential rain and the release of water from the Lagdo Dam from neighboring Cameroon, where several farming and fishing communities located by the banks of the River Benue have been submerged. Executive Secretary Adamawa State's Emergency Management Agency enumerates the level of devastation. This situation is one the leadership of the local government authority feels needs immediate intervention. Relief materials are in short supply and where it's available, only a few can access them. The devastation is just too much. As we are talking, even yesterday we were able to recover two dead bodies in Demsa. So this brings to a total of 51 people on our record that lost their lives as a result of this flooding here in Adamawa State this year. Okay. And then we have uh, 71 persons that have sustained different degree of uh, injuries. We have about 80,000 hectares of farmlands estimated to have been destroyed and then over 171,000 being affected. If we say affected, does not mean displaced. Displaced, we have over 10,000 people displaced, but over 171,000 have been affected. Blood victims, who are mostly women and children, live in makeshift huts, public schools, and with anyone willing to take them in on higher grounds. The paramount ruler of the Bakma Kingdom in southern Adamawa is unhappy with the response of government to the plight of the victims, whom he says are in need of food, water, and health care. Government at all levels, the local government, the state government, and the federal government should look at this thing that is happening and should come to the aid and assistance of communities that have been ravaged by this thing uh, properly. While they are looking at the possibility of uh, uh, giving them short-term solutions like feeding and other clothing and the rest of them, we must find long-term solutions to the challenges. What are the real causes of this flood? Is it rain? If it is not rain, what is the cause? Looking ahead, he also wants government at all levels to put in place lasting solutions that will bring an end to the perennial flooding that renders people homeless and jobless.